I teach because I love to learn. I'm a totally different teacher than when I first started teaching. John Nitschka, PhD, and PNG is a member of APEGA. John is an associate professor in the Department of Chemical and Materials Engineering at the University of Alberta's Faculty of Engineering. His mission is to train people in the creation and dissemination of knowledge. Redefining failure as a positive and integral part of teaching and learning has allowed Dr. Nitschka to explore the various ways of challenging students in order to keep them and himself engaged and motivated. I didn't think I'd be a university professor when I was young. No. I remember going to junior high school and watching the kids get off the bus. We were going to university and I thought, oh, that could never be me. I didn't think I had it in me. Uh, but then I just started trying. Do your best, my dad said, and so that's what I did. I love experimenting. And teaching is a big experiment for me. And I think that's what it really is. is I love doing any kind of experiment. Can I teach this better? Can I communicate this better. So every time I teach, I'm doing an experiment. And so that's what the drive is for me, is to keep those experimentation um, attitudes going. To both inspire them to work hard and to be popular is a challenge. And the only way to do it is to be very innovative, to attract their interest, but at the same time push them. And not everybody can do that, and, and John is very good at it. He demands the most from his students, but he also gets them so interested in the course that they hardly notice how hard they work. They all want to come into materials engineering after they take John's course. It's, it's quite interesting to watch. <laughs> I have a, a pedagogical approach I developed, which is called Room with a View. So the acronym A-V-U-E is basically accessibility, uh, visualization, unexpectedness, and engagement. So if you incorporate some kind of visual, emotional response in there, you're much higher probability of getting people engaged and get into more effective learning. So I thought, hmm, how do we get a little bit of mystery? Well, I need to take a box to class anyway to carry my markers, my notes, all these demonstrations. I thought, hmm, let's just paint it black and put a little note on there what's in the box. So there's some mystery now. And so walking to class, people always ask me, oh, my class, is it, what's in the box? Dans des démonstrations qui font sa renommée, John va jusqu'à casser des cordes de guitare et congeler des canards de plastique pour capter l'intérêt des étudiants et leur expliquer de façon amusante des concepts complexes. And now there's a small version of the box which is part of the course and it's a little metal kit with a whole bunch of little items in it. And the students have that as a required item for their lab and they have design challenges based on using all that content inside. So it's very much like, here's your box, you have 20 minutes, design something to do this, go. John's actually pretty much the entire reason I'm in materials engineering. Uh, from his course, I saw how much he really enjoyed materials engineering when he gave, he used to give these presentations with Silly Putty all the time, I still think he does. And that got me really interested and I saw how passionate he was about it. So I figured it was something I should try and, and then I became really passionate about it. And now he's led me on to research, and, and now I'm addicted to research too, so probably move on to a graduate level of research after this as well. I'd like to try to reach more of my colleagues around the world. How can I get them more excited and give them more accessible examples to teach with? So I have my own teaching method that I think is working. I'd like to share that and just, can we bring up education everywhere? For his commitment to teaching, innovation and excellence, Engineers Canada is proud to present to John Nitschke the 2012 Medal for Distinction in Engineering Education. <laughs>